Hello everybody, this is Havoc and welcome back to Terminus Total War playing as the province of Hispania. In the last episode, we wrecked the Jutes. I mean, absolutely destroyed them. And I found out what those darty thingies are. Let me pull it up real quick because it's actually quite interesting. I find it interesting, so I'm going to share it with you guys because I think it's interesting. Uh, okay. Hmm. Well... I thought I had it. Maybe we'll go ahead. We're going to go ahead and fight this battle. We are fighting the Geats. They have attacked us with a not even remotely strong force compared to what we just fought. So this should be a freaking breeze. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Come on. Where is it? Where is it? Because I think it's really, really cool. It's called the Plimbata, which is a massive iron dart. It was lighter, and more could be carried by the more mobile legions of 350 AD and beyond. That is awesome. Oh, and it's freaking freezing. This is cool. Okay, so we got uh, units deployed over there, which is no big deal. It says I can't take these guys on, but I know I can. We got their main army. I'm still feeling building it right there. Still think that would be worth it. So we're going to put our soldiers here. And of course I am flexible at the moment, so... We can definitely cater to our certain needs but what I really like is those guys are not even ranked oh that's my crappy little deployment zone okay no worries there we do have our axemen got a general um, that is metaphorical. It's not actually there. Then let's go... There, with the unit Legio. I thought it was Legio. Actually, no, I say Legio. Right? I don't know. Uh, and then we got that dude there. This dude here. So they could all throw their pelums and stuff. And we'll drop these guys behind here. I don't know, just in case. Anyone else? Is there anyone else that needs deployed? There we go. Okay. We'll just kind of group them all together. Come out here. Indeed I shall. Wow, that was fast. And... Get wrecked by my plimbatas. Actually, those are actual javelins. Never mind. These are going to be plimbatas. Pew, 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 pew. Get wrecked. Dang it. Meant to be going after them. Whoopsie daisy. Huzzah! No, he's not. Go ahead, waste your ammo on me. Yeah, we got kind of wrecked by that catapult there. Slaughter them! Slaughter the raiders! How are they winning decisively? Well, send in reinforcements. 
Uh, it's a little too late to send reinforcements to that group. Those guys are dead. They did get wrecked, didn't they? Let's go ahead and get rid of these cav. I'm more than willing to use some of my missile ranged units. Though again. There we go. Halt. Alto. Get wrecked, son. Perfect. Perfect. Let's see now. Uh, we'll go ahead and draw your troops out here. Draw these troops out here. I need to get these guys back in line. Get these guys back in line. Now we prepare for the real assault. We've still lost a good amount of men, unfortunately. I have very poor skills this morning. Pew 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 pew. Sniping a snipe, snipe the general. And they really don't have a whole lot of range. I guess they have some troops over there. Come up there. If we could snipe his general out. Sigstein? The Nordic Warlord. I'll wait till he gets out of cover of those buildings and then I'll turn the skirmisher on. Throw, Spearman. You're cool. This does, uh, does look actually kind of epic right there. It really does. Alright, so they're going to move along. They're going to mass swarm those guys, which is perfectly fine. No, stay right here, please. I'll go ahead and use my ammo for those guys. Well worth it. Use them. Too late. Go ahead and wreck those guys as well. Move these guys up there. This is where we thrive, boys. This is where we thrive. Those Nordic bikemen are going to get demolished. <laughs> I love it too much. Like, I think I really enjoy it a little too much that these guys are getting destroyed. We'll actually put those guys up there first. Here we go, wreck them. Norse Berserkers, these are the guys that we really need to kill. Throw them. There we go, they're unarmored. There we go, boys. Defensive Testudo. Scare him. Hit him hard. Oh, my word. There we go. Hit 
Hit him where it hurts, boys. Oh, we're losing decisively. Actually, no, do that first. We ready? Hit him hard. Quickly. There we go. Did that just absolutely not work at all? No, that actually worked very well. Get out of there. I have not been in good command of my cab today. Very, very poor use of my cab today. All right, men, get out of there. Hit him hard. Push. Oh wow, okay, well they're just gonna melt. That's fun. Need to route those pikemen. Yeah, that's random. They're just all of a sudden up and routing. I have been very poor today, guys. I apologize for how poorly I am using my my troops today. Very much not like me. There we go. Gaining the upper hand a little bit. Um, let's go after these guys. They're going to fight to the death. My Norse Berserkers over here, not my Norse Berserkers, but the Norse Berserkers are actually slaughtering my men. Yeah, this is a very, very, very poor battle on my part. Shameful display. There we go. Take down the last of them. Awesome. Reform the lines. We got it. Yeah, we got this. That guy's gonna route pretty quick. Gonna go ahead and lash out at him. And then, gonna get my general in this mix. Gonna kinda surround him a bit. Gonna get these guys into a frenzy. Just a second. Because I'm a pretty good buff. Plus 10 melee attack. The expense of 50% fatigue when it's over with. No, not the settlement. Go, go, go. Super fast forward time. He needs to die. No, 
No, once the general dies, then I can quit the quit the battle. Yeah, very very poor. I apologize again. It is very early in the morning. But that is no excuse for the piss poor game that I just played. We still wrecked them. And we only lost 900 to their entire army. Alright, well their general is effectively dead. We're going to go ahead and in the battle. Heroic victory indeed. 824 men. Those guys still did a lot of work. They're berserkers, man. Hands down. Some crazy, crazy troops. Um, units replenished, or should we just kill them? Um, we'll take on their warriors, I guess. Are you serious right now? The Huns, there are the Huns. Oh man, if you haven't seen the Achaean episode, we took them on and we beat the crap out of them. It was wonderful and glorious. There you go, take out the Geats. There you go. Kamulo Dunham. <laughs> you just keep getting wrecked. It's like every time we rebuild it, it just gets attacked again and again. And again. Enemy killed in battle. Disease spreads. Oh no. That's terrible. Last episode we also did reduce our corruption level. Which is really good. Um, We'll give melee attack plus 6. Then we're going to go over here to sentinel. Camel of Dunham is currently in the negative with food. Which means we are not replenishing. Sigontium. So Uh, we can hire some cheap troops. That's not cheap. That's not cheap either. Wow, that's really not cheap. Huh. Well, we'll do that. That's better than nothing. And then some common to Tensa Spears. Heroic victory, rank gain, faction emergence of the Nidians. Interesting, unseasonable conditions. Alright, now we were working down south a little bit. I don't know if we still need to or not. Building some trade jetties there. We're working on public order. I think we pretty much almost got it under control. What's our sanitation look like? Plus four? I'm going to go ahead and build an adobe dryer. Well, does it matter? No. I mean, if we got one buff, I'm just going to go down Pewter Caster. I think that'll work. Uh, so we still got a nice little army over here. Leave none alive. There we go. Take on its reinforcements. Come back over here. They gained... Oh, good. Bar against Barbarian Kingdoms. That's what I need. For sure. Recruitment costs or unit experience. Um, We're actually going to do replenishment. Hit that in turn. Publius Caesarius Saecilius. Yeah. That. All right, well, we've got to get stuff done up in Britannia because this public order thing is freaking ridiculous. It is absolutely ridiculous. There go the Huns again. I don't know how we're going to fight them, to be completely honest. really have no clue. 
I kind of hope that we go to war with the Utes. Because I will completely leave... <laughs> this is awful. But I'll leave the province of Batani out to dry. I need the entirety of the continent, of the country of England. Attrition. That's fine. Term of office. Religious sanctions. Many pagans fill our lands. Do they deserve equal rights? Uh, no. We will impose Celtic. We will impose sanctions. Uh, what about you guys? Do they have a pretty good army? kind of have a feeling they do. <laughs> Excellent armor piercing damage. Mercenary gaze hounds. Oh, they're cheap. I will take them on. I really don't have a lot of skirmishers, and those really do work well in battle. What else could I do? Those guys are really expensive. Oh my, please say that's just our catapult spam. Nordic warriors, some Nordic mounted. Hmm. We're gonna retreat. Just gonna get a few more units. Oh man. Decisive victory. We're going to kill the captives. I really didn't want to fight that one. That one did not look fun. Four catapults is a little ridiculous. There we go. Uh, and then I just take out... Oh no, that's mine. Let's do this. Gain all my troops back. Get into Ablana, and boom. Public order restored. We do need some sanitation. But that requires going to war, and I can't go to war yet. Alright, so that worked. I mean, that soaked up all of our funds, which kind of sucks. But... Yeah, I mean, we're actually not doing too bad. We're finally leveling out over here. These guys have finally leveled. And then we're making really good strides here. We may actually be able to move out of Londinium. Or out of the land of oh, the Brits here in a little bit. And what I also need to do is I need to go up there and probably take those units out. The Abdonians, I do believe. And those guys are still pestering the crap out of me. They don't stop, do they? They just don't stop. A bunch of Nordic pikemen couple of Huskarls. They did bring a whole bunch of Warhounds, which is a little different than what they'd done before. We're gonna fight it. Good old AI stack spam. We can hold it. We know how to take them out. It's just frustrating. It's like, come on, man. Do something a little different here. Especially since I haven't had time to recoup. Makes it a little bit of a pain. Oh, and it's foggy as crap. That's awesome. Gonna do the same thing, man. Where are those guys? They're over here this time. You guys are good. You guys are good. You guys. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Are you freaking kidding me? The unit placement in this game sometimes is just freaking ridiculous. Go there. Got an extra unit to cover this base. Let's 
We've got Comet to Tensis. And then I've got five sets of horsemen, which don't really amount to a whole lot, to be completely honest. And then we'll drop that guy there. Everything's fair. That's fine. Bring it. Are you still talking? Ow. Ow, that hurt. The enemy should know when the odds are hopeless. I don't want you coming after my horsemen. You can take my tower, that's fine. I also give you full permission to use all the ranged weapons you need. Just don't hit your own troops. Slaughter them, boys. Yeah, you deserve to get completely and absolutely wrecked. Suck it. You just thought you were being cool by jumping over fences and stuff, but you're just getting destroyed. Tired of your crap, son, and they are just demolishing me. We're gonna go after those cow bolts. Yeah, that didn't work out so well for you, did it? Uh, I need to turn all these guys off. I don't mind using my skirmishers for that. Get wrecked. I should be pew pewing these guys. Thank you very much. There we go. Got those guys taken care of. Let's get down over here. Path for the second wave. You know what? No. Don't even. You need to delay key troops. Or you could just deploy. Whatever. It's whatever you choose to do. Get right here. Did we destroy them? No, we didn't. There we go. Now they're destroyed. Uh, let's go ahead and work on these guys. We're going to use our ranged attack. Try and take them uh, down a little bit. But look at this. Yes, it's working. That's right. It's so awkward. Actually, if he's going to land right here, I'm going to work on their general. Let's go ahead and get back into tight square, tight formation. See if we can't take out some archers real quick. Now, do their dogs come on board? I don't think they do, so that really makes them a pretty good useless unit. Which is exactly what I need right now. Five. Five, five. How are we doing over here? Good. Hit him. Yep, their dogs don't come off with them, which is awesome. What are they doing? You guys are doing good. Go 
Those Warhounds are going to get wrecked. Going to wreck those Thrall Skirmishers as well. That was pretty cool. Or it looked like they were throwing them right as soon as they were hopping over the fence. That would have been a pretty cool little trick there. Kill as many of them as you can. Kill as many of them as you can. Get out of there. These guys are not meant for you. Go here. Go over here. Hit those guys in the back. Yes! Yes! Go over here, hit those guys. Five. Kill all the Thrall Skirmishers. Here's the rest of their army in mass. Now we're doing much better than we were last time. We've only lost 150 men and we've killed over 900. I would say that's pretty daggum successful. Oh, that hurts. Please obey my orders. Building's glitching. Boys, I right, boys, appreciate your service. Every man you take out is one less we have to worry about in the future. Here we go. Yeah, they're gonna get demolished. We'll give them some melee defense buffs just in case. But yeah, they're dead. All right, boys. Some heavy melee infantry right here. Come at me. Come at me. There you go. Turn off. Need you for the big guys. Any troops up here? You're gonna get wrecked, dude. You have no idea. You have no idea. We can take on those warhounds. I hope we can take on those warhounds. He's already getting wrecked. He's not gonna make it. Oh, you're just gonna get mowed over. Fantastic, man. Let's get over into here. Let's get these guys out and get these guys in. Get those guys right there. Get our skirmishers out. These Matty Arii. Watch this. This is going to be a whole house slaughter right here. Whole house slaughter. And yes, we're going way over our usual limit, which is fine. They broke in through. We 
We can hold them. Form Testudo. Go, go, go. Break off. Get wrecked, Hot Scarls. Get demolished. Shield wall. No worries. Collapse. Melee de or morale debuff. We should be hitting those Huskarls in the back. Should be giving them a really good debuff right there. Who? Oh, wow. Oh, wow. There we go. Kill the Huskarls. There we go. Nordic Marauders. Is his name Gandalf? Oh, it's called Roof. Thought it was Gandalf for a second. Get wrecked. There we go. Can't stand the onslaught. We haven't even gone into frenzy yet. 15 left, okay. All they have now are some pikemen. They do have some more Nordic band. There's not much we can do about that right now, though. Come around here. Don't get your pikes down. Ooh, that's a bad position for us to be in. Uh, let's go ahead and commit. Give us some frenzy. And let's go around back, shall we? Those guys are wavering. Oh, the whole army's wavering. Oh, this is perfect. Yes. Feel our wrath. Awesome. For real. Sweet. Well, that little last charge was unexpected in terms of routing them, so that works. Just go after him and kill as many of them as you can. Do we have anyone not doing anything? Really need to go out and get that artillery crew. Really need to reach out and take those guys on. And there's a lot of people we're not going after. Come on, man. I mean, like, really? Especially need to go after the warlord. Very nice. Nope, we are going to wrap this up. We are going to make sure all of them are dead, or as many of them as possible anyways. There we go. Hit those guys. We won't worry about that dude over there. We're not going to reach him in time. But everyone else. It is entirely feasible to kill. 
absolutely no mercy. That guy is just about to the edge. One lone survivor. Heroic victory indeed. We only lost 573 that time, and we took out 2,500 men. That's what I'm talking about. Keep on throwing your armies at me. The only thing you're doing is creating some pretty elite units. The Children of Doom. I will take your reinforcements. I wish I could just kill their king. That's what I really, really want to do. Let's see if uh, the king of the province of Gaul does anything. And the Huns are officially moving into Roman territory and the province of Germania. Yeah, that's right. Get your armies down there. Is Rome doing anything? I don't... There's some armies of Rome. Looks like they are sending some forces to help defend. I've got my own things to worry about. Enemy killed in battle. Faction destroyed the Ostrogoths. Wow, attrition. Yes. Disease spread, consumption, religious sanctions... Yes, I know. Public order up to minus 10. And again. Just, oh my word. Okay, we can... Oh, wow. Okay, so we got... Construction of a pewter thingy. Development of new tactics. Which means we now have Lenkiarii, Signores. Replaces Comitatensis Spears. And Legio Comitatensis replaces the Legio. And then Cataphractarii replaces Contarii. It's a bit more expensive, but they do have some really good units. No! That's not what I wanted to do at all. Nice! Kill you! Die! Kill the captives. Scurry on back. And we need to build some more units. I'm gonna build a couple more of those guys. Uh, those guys will take three turns. Good lord, you might as well just freaking destroy it. Okay, so we got those. And uh, we're going to go... Uh, we'll go to Specialized Craftsman. Because that'll be really helpful there. The Geats are down at that point, which is fine by me. I don't really care. Uh, we could get some more. Oh, that increased Squalor. We've already got a 3% chance of killing them, or of getting disease. These guys, what else can I do? You know what? I can raid their territory. Do I really need to be there? Yeah, I do. Just for a few turns. I can... Upgrade all of those guys. Really doesn't cost that much different. Do we have a missile? Oh, good. They do have a missile weapon. I'm going to stay here. I mean, that's plus 13 per turn that I can use. Those guys get increased as well. We're going to take our army down here. Level them all up to... Awesome. Well, we don't have much money left, but we are greater in power. Awesome, guys. Well, that is the end of this episode. If you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. Follow me on Twitch, Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram. Be on the lookout for the next episode. The Jutes and the Geats, they are both being torn apart, and it's amazing, and I love it. And they can all suck it trying to keep taking the same freaking spot. Isn't going to work, guys. But anyways, see you in the next episode. This is Havoc, and I'm out of here. Peace.